Did you know sugar can be just as stressful on your liver as alcohol can? Especially fructose. So sugar is 50% fructose and 50% glucose. And according to Dr. Robert Lustig, he found that fructose is gram for gram as tough on your liver as alcohol is. So how many grams of alcohol is in a standard drink? It's a good question that most people don't know the answer to. It's actually 14 grams of alcohol in one standard drink. So if you see something with 28 grams of sugar added in it, you divide that by two to get the fructose, and that would be 14, which is just as strainful as one standard drink. So for instance, this twisted tea right here contains 26 grams of sugar. So when you do the quick math on it, you'll find that one of these twisted teas is basically like 1.93 standard drinks in terms of total stress on your liver. So you need to be weary about all the sugar that's inside your alcoholic drinks so that you don't put unnecessary stress on your liver. So if you're looking to feel better after a night of drinking, definitely cut out the sugar and try this. It's Cheers Restore. And it's an after alcohol aid that'll help two drinks feel like one. Let us explain. The primary two ingredients in Cheers Restore are DHM and L-cysteine. And those two ingredients get to the two root causes of why you truly feel bad. And no, it's not dehydration. That's only 10 to 20% of why you actually feel bad the next day. The main two reasons are really GABA rebound and acetaldehyde exposure. GABA rebound, that's the psychological sensation you feel after a fun night out. Why you have so much brain fog, head discomfort, might be a little jittery, and probably didn't sleep well. That can be attributed to GABA rebound. And the second leading reason is acetaldehyde exposure. That's the toxic byproduct of alcohol, and it's actually 20 times more toxic than the alcohol is itself. So you may want the alcohol because it feels good, but you don't want what it turns into, the acetaldehyde. Yeah, because that's the toxic part, and that's what can really do a number on your poor little liver right here. But the main two ingredients, DHM and L-cysteine, actually help to reduce those main two factors why you truly feel bad the day after drinking. The DHM in Cheers buffers GABA rebound by binding to the same brain receptors that alcohol binds to, the GABA receptors, to effectively satiate that receptor and lessen that rebound the next day, where your head is not turned upside down as much. But also, DHM assists in the clearance of acetaldehyde by speeding up the enzyme activity of ALDH, which helps convert acetaldehyde into acetate, and then you just pee it out. So then, what helps with acetaldehyde? That would be L cysteine. It's an amino acid that not only boosts glutathione production, but it also reduces acetaldehyde levels. Because whenever acetaldehyde is in your system, L cysteine comes into play and forms a non toxic compound called MTCA, which effectively neutralizes that acetaldehyde. So that's why Cheers Restore is dual action. It helps reduce GABA rebound and the exposure to acetaldehyde. So if you want to feel better after drinking, obviously avoid the added sugar, and also take three of these right after your last drink or right before bed. Because it'll work its magic while you sleep so that you can wake up feeling like you had half as many drinks the next morning. Cheers was on Shark Tank. We're already in over 30,000 retail doors and packaging like these. And you can purchase this one. You get the best price on the TikTok shop and have it delivered to your house in only a couple days. So if you take Cheers and you're not satisfied and you don't feel like you had half as many drinks, hit us up and we'll give you a full refund, no questions asked. So what are you waiting for? Let the science work while you sleep and feel better the next morning.